Teachers have always been able to add YouTube videos to Schoology through embed code, but a new feature in Schoology makes this process even easier with, and you won't even need to use embed code. So before we get started, you'll need to make sure you have the YouTube app added to your Schoology account. Go into the resources menu, which is in the banner across the top and go into apps. This is a one-time addition that you will have to make. You can see in my resource apps that I have listed, I have YouTube right here. If you don't have YouTube listed, all you need to do is go to the install apps link and you'll see YouTube listed. You put a little check mark by YouTube and choose install. After it's installed, if you click on the name, there's a one time blue button that pops up that says authorize. You don't have to have a YouTube account. You don't need to sign into anything, but you do need to click that blue authorize button. So once YouTube lives in your Schoology resource apps, you can use it to easily add videos to all sorts of different places in Schoology. So now I'm gonna pop back over to a course. So you could just go to your courses menu and choose the course where you want the video to be. I'm gonna use this course for my demonstration. And then use the add materials button. Now you can add YouTube videos to several of the tools in Schoology. You can put it on an assignment page, put it in a test or a quiz. You can add it to a discussion so students can watch the video and then talk about it. And you can put it on a page. I will use the page example for my demo. All of the tools I just mentioned in Schoology have this similar rich text editing toolbar. If yours is not as wide as mine, there'll be a little arrow over here on the right where you can expand it out so that you have all of the tools visible to you. You need to title your page. You can add directions if you'd like to before the video. And then just put your cursor right where you want the video to appear, the embedded video. Now you'll go over to the insert content menu. You will see YouTube listed in the right column. These are my resource apps that I have connected. So I'll choose YouTube. And from here, I can search for the video. If I choose the title, I'm able to preview the video to see what it looks like, make sure it's the right one. Alternately, if I already have the URL for the video, here's that same video on YouTube. I could just copy this and come back to Schoology and search by URL if I know exactly which video I want. And then you just use the gear icon next to the video and choose import as embed. So Schoology is gonna do all the embed code writing for you and drop the video on your page or discussion or assignment right here. It looks like a big yellow box right now because I'm in editing mode. I can adjust the dimensions of the video by clicking on it and dragging, or sometimes it's better just to use this little tool right here. It looks like a photograph, but it allows me to adjust the video dimensions. 640 by 360 is fine, so I'm gonna leave it set that way. And then I will just save my changes or choose create. So there's my page, watch the video, power of words. The advantage of embedding a video in Schoology is well first students will be able to watch it just right here on the page instead of heading out to youtube and potentially not coming back but also if they're at school iboss is going to not block this video so they'll be able to actually watch a youtube video without you running around and bypassing the filter for everybody so that's how you embed a video in schoology again you can do it on a page and a discussion assignments and quizzes